Guys, welcome back to some Southwest Florida. Today, I'm gonna take you guys on a little bit of an adventure. We're gonna go through the storyline of how I made friends with all of the different people in my story, including Sammy, Mashfi, Peeps, and even more. We're gonna cover some of the crazy moments that we've been through, obviously including when we met, but also some of the stuff that brought us closer together. This is gonna be a super cool video because it showcases all of our best moments, how we became super close friends, and how you guys can maybe join in as well. I really want you guys to watch this one all the way through, so what I'm gonna do for you today is actually include a bunch of Roblox gift card codes throughout the video. They're gonna be hidden, so you're gonna have to watch the video. I know some of the more dedicated viewers are gonna watch this and get those codes super quick, so you gotta be super fast, watch through the whole thing. So what are we waiting for? Let's start things off with my very first friend in Florida, Sammy. <sighs> Another day in Southwest Florida. Uh, where is Lotus? Oh, oh yeah, she went to work. That's right. Okay. Well, I guess it's just me today and at least I can go and get some coffee to start my day bright and early. I'm really proud of Lotus. She's been working super hard so that she could buy her very own supercar at some point. So hopefully very soon she's going to have one of these as well or even something else. I wonder what she'd buy. What do you guys think she should buy? Let me know in the comments. Oh snap, I got to get gas. Okay, let's go do that first. All right, let's pick up some gas really quick. Ah, there we go, much better. Now we got a full tank of gas. All I need is a little bit of coffee to start my day. You know what? I'm sort of feeling like getting some Starbucks today. So let's go grab a coffee, maybe some breakfast. Oh, looks like this guy's in line first. Okay, I'll just wait for him. Wait, what's his name? Sammy the Millionaire. Oh, okay. Oh, everything is just digital now? There's literally nobody here. Who am I supposed to talk to to get my coffee? Let me just ask this guy. Hey, how did you get your coffee? I don't know who to ask. Oh, he ordered it online. Oh, okay, I thought so. Through the Starbucks app. All right, let me do the same thing then. Okay, there we go. And now I guess I just pick up my own coffee? This is so weird. Oh, whoa, who the heck is this guy? He just says, what's up? Um, <laughs> okay, uh, I guess this is how it works. Can I have a coffee too? He says, y'all want a coffee? Yeah, wait, how did this just happen? I called on the phone app and then someone just randomly appeared. I'm just gonna tell this guy, that was weird, eh? Oh, sweet, my coffee's ready. All right, thanks. Hey, bro, do you want to sit down with me? He says, yeah, sure, man. Oh, cool, all right, let's do it. He says, why not? He says, nice to meet you. Let me say, nice to meet you too. Oh, and he says, what's your name? Matrix. How about you? Um, obviously you can see my username, but you know what? I might as well just uh, be friendly with him. He's trying to tell me his name, but everything gets tagged. So I just said, don't worry, I can read your username. Oh, he said, would you guys like to order a cake pop or a donut? I'll take a donut. <laughs> He's still trying to tell me his name. Oh, sweet. My donut's here already. Dang, this guy's fast. Hey, can I be honest, bro? I said, are you rich or something? I said, you're wearing expensive clothes, so I just kind of wanted to ask. And he says, I actually am. Oh, snap. Wait, you're rich? What? Like, how rich? I'm just curious. <laughs> I got my big break when I made my business from selling loads of exotic cars. Yo, I love exotic cars. Wait, what? That's so cool. That's like the coolest way to get rich. He says, I'm talking multi, multi millions. Oh, cool. Do you have one? Uh, yeah, I do. I actually love exotic cars. Yeah, I, I'm a big fan. I mean, I don't have like the most expensive one. He says, what car? I said, uh, it's just a 570 McLaren. Nothing too crazy, you know? I said, I'm still trying to get rich. And he says, that's really good still, man. Oh, he says, I actually have a Conan Seg one-to-one. -one. Yo, what? And I said, do you think you can show me how to be rich too? He says, it's actually parked outside. He said, yeah, of course. Yo, really? Yo, he's actually gonna teach me how to get like super rich? Oh my God. Okay, this is exciting. I wanna be rich. He says, yeah, of course. He says, come, I'll show you. Oh, snap, okay. Yo, we're actually gonna learn how to be rich today. Oh, frick, okay. What, dude, is this his ride? A Conan Seg one-to-one? -one? I said, I kinda didn't believe you at first, but here it is. Okay, clearly you were telling the truth then. 
Yo, this thing looks sick, dude. He says, um, it's actually a rare one. Bro, how much was this? I mean, like, this must have costed you a lot of money. Yo, look at all the other McLarens here today. What the heck? Everybody in Florida is so rich. I'm so glad me and Lotus moved here. And he said, we're talking... 5.2 million dollars what i said this is my mclaren right here it was 0 0.2 million dollars he says oh <laughs> um yeah man it's it's pretty nice it's just like a starter so is this the only car you have bro he says hell no bro so he spent five and a half million on this and he's got more he says i have plenty more i have a whole business i literally said you're living my dream how do i get like you he says i have a one-to-one -one. i have a hennessy venom f5 all i said was uh could i like see those they sound amazing also what is that car he says of course no way he's actually gonna show me all of his cars this is crazy i have more cars at my mansion i mean he does have a conan seg one-to-one -one, so i guess he should have a big house he says of course he said it's hard work opening a whole car business yeah bro i believe it yo even his phone is solid gold bro look at my crap phone yo what do he say he says by the way this baby has a drip too wait what <laughs> Oh, drop top. That's what he meant to say. Oh, snap, dude. This is nuts. Yo, I kind of was like, what the heck? At first, convertible, my friend. Nice, dude. Yo, even the headlights are carbon fiber. What the heck? Holy smokes, dude. Yo, this guy's whipping. Yo, we're going to crash. <laughs> chill. Yo, chill. Chill, dude. I don't want to die. He's like, this car is literally insane. Dude, if I get rich like you, I'm probably going to be the exact same way. Just ripping around in like $5 million cars. I just said, you're living the dream life, man. Like, this is crazy. He said, I am indeed my friend. Oh, he called me his friend. Yo, these are the kinds of friends you got to make. Yo, is that his house up there, dude? What? That thing's crazy. He says, here we are. Oh, snap, dude. This is nuts. What? This is so freaking cool, dude. What the heck? He's literally like right on the beach too. Man, what a beautiful house. I get sea views every single day, bro. He says, it's absolutely wonderful, man. I wish I wasn't living in a stinky apartment. Yo, look at this place. What the heck? He says, you're welcome, my friend. Nice, dude. Yo, I'm just going to start looking around. He's locking the door too. Okay. Yo, look at the TV, bro. This is so sick, dude. What? He says, here's the lounge. We got a double kitchen. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that. I said, yo, is this an elevator right here? Oh, shoot, dude. What? Is this the second or third floor? I gotta take a look. What the heck? Look at all these rooms. Bro, and he's got a fireplace in each room, too. I just said, dude, you could get lost in this house. Like, how the heck are you supposed to know where everything is? Yo, look at this view, man. Okay, this is the craziest house ever. I, I gotta get rich. I want a house like this. He's like, sometimes I still do, and I've lived here for over a year. Wow, he still gets lost here sometimes. Bro, this is unreal. Man, I gotta get rich. What am I doing with my life? Oh my god, dude. I just said, yo, oh shoot, I was gonna ask if I could jump in the pool, but I already did. This is so amazing, man. I'm so motivated now. He's got another, like, kitchen here, too. Bro, this is so crazy. Yo, what is this? Is this part of his garage or something? Hold on, I gotta turn these lights on. I'm just like exploring all over at this point. I'm just too curious. I just said to him, dude, this is insane, man. Like, you you have made it in this life. Oh my god, where am I now? Oh, I think we're back at the front of the house. He's like, there's plenty to explore in this house. Yeah, dude, obviously. He's like, actually, you know what? Let me show you something else. And I was like, can I see more of your cars, bro? <laughs> Let's see what he's gonna tell me. Yeah, that's what I was just about to say. Oh, heck yeah, bro. Bro, he's got the Venom. And he's like, haha, crazy, right? Dude, literally the most insane car ever. This is so motivating. We got 1,800 horsepower in this bad boy. What? Yo. Holy crud, this thing sounds amazing. I said, dude, someday you gotta show me how to get rich like you, man. He says, of course. Yo, someday we're gonna be rich too. Let's go. 
So guys, that is how I made friends with Sammy, one of the best friends I possibly could have ever asked for in Southwest Florida. What did you think of the way we met? He honestly surprised the heck out of me by being as rich as he is. I did not expect that when I started talking to him, but he's a super cool and very, very humble guy, and I'm very glad to be friends with him. As you'll see throughout the series, Sammy is one of the most trustworthy and dependable friends you could possibly ask for, not to mention he always comes up with some of the most fun things to do and that kind of leads into how I made friends with even my other friends so we're gonna move on and we're gonna talk about how I made friends with Mashpee who also became one of my closest friends in all of Florida so let's get started with his story hey Lotus you want to get something to eat yes I'm starving all right let's go let's go for a ride it's so nice you finally have your own car and I don't have to keep you in mine all the time I know and now I can erase you too because you're slow I'm slow in my Bugatti? Are you kidding me? I mean, look at it. It just looks like a slowpoke car. Okay, okay. I'm gonna pretend you didn't just say that. Let's just go get some <laughs> McDonald's or something, all right? Okay. All right, what are you gonna get at McBloxers? Probably a nugget combo. Nugget combo? You? Ew. I'm gonna get a triple quarter pounder with cheese, and I want extra fries and supersize my drink. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're gonna get fat from that. I ain't gonna get fat. That's that's my yes, light meal, are. right? That's my light that's meal. That's your light meal. You better believe it. I don't even it. want to know what your heavy meal is. Wait, wait, Lotus. Before we go in, do you see this thing? What is this? Some Ferrari? Ooh. Yo, this thing is ugly. What the heck are they doing with these <laughs> wheels? What? All right. Uh, whoa. Holy crud. Look at that kid's face. What the heck? Ah, he just approached us. He's like, Yo. hey, man. Yo. What's up? with your face <laughs> i have to ask man no what is going on he says uh don't ask okay he says i scare kids dude you scare okay. me bro and i'm not even a kid <laughs> okay where is our server is there nobody here to get food from you know what i'm gonna just go back here and get some food myself i'll get a Grab me some nuggets. cheeseburger oh i can't get it oh dang it hold up i'm gonna say where's the servers like where are we supposed to get our food from He's like, uh, I don't know. It's modern devices. Oh, okay. So oh. I guess we just order online or something. The kiosk behind you, probably. Oh, okay. Well, anyways, you order with your phone. Here, I'll do that. You can talk to him. I said, did you see that ugly car outside? He says, ugly car? Uh, do you mean the Ferrari? He said, that thing's a beast, bro. I'm like, but it was built pretty ugly. Like, that's, that's all. I mean, it's still a Ferrari. Like, you know, at the end of the day, it's still nice. He's like, it's oh. mine. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh shoot. No. My bad, bro. <laughs> okay, I didn't mean to insult your car like that, dude. I just, I, I, I don't know, man. It looked kind of weird. Yeah, I'm gonna say, why does it look like that? It's kind of weird. He said, I had to put the drag tires on so it doesn't fly away fly Damn. away i was like why would it fly away bro he said that's how fast it is okay <laughs> dude no way i said my bugatti doesn't even fly away and it's insane he's like uh sounds like you don't believe me i mean it's just a ferrari bro he says why not race me oh shoot uh i'll race him hold up hold up let's go let's go see it first all right, let's go see this thing and let's see what the heck he's talking about. So he's got his Ferrari. These are our rides. Let me just tell him. He says, Bice, wait, oh, nice cars, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he being so nice to us? I kind of feel bad for being like rude now and get saying his car is ugly. Well, I mean, he did say he scares kids with his face, so I don't think he's offended. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I guess so. I'm gonna say, to be honest, bro, I don't think you can race my Bugatti. It wouldn't be fair to you, honestly. Uh, so actually, you know what, Lotus? You just got your Audi, right? Yeah. You know what? Let's let's try something. I have an idea. He says your car is nothing compared to mine. Yo, what is this guy thinking right now? I said, how about you race my girlfriend's car first, and if you win, you can verse me. And he says, easy. Wow, you, bro. What? Yo, you, you think it's gonna be easy. You better show That's him, Lotus. It. You better show him. All right, let's go. He says, let's do it. All right, we're gonna do it. You ready, Lotus? I'm ready. All right, three, two, one, go. Oh, shoot. Yeah, there you go, Lotus. There you go. Oh, oh. you're smoking him. Yo, oh, wait, he's catching up. <gasps> he oh, no! passed you. I saw that. He what? passed you at the end. How did he even do that? That was close. That was close. I don't think he has a chance against my Bugatti. Did you guys race all the way to the end? Yeah, we did. We okay, hit the who, who won at the end? He did. Wow, he says easy win. 
dude, barely. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I said to the guy, I'm like, you wanna make a bet? Oh, he's like, why not? I said, if I win, I get $1,000. How about that? And if you win, I'll give you $5,000. Okay, easy money, he says. All right, Lotus, hop in my car. I'll, I'll do the countdown. Okay. All right, bro, you ready? I mean, you almost had him, Lotus. So here we go. I'm gonna say on third honk. Okay. All right, let's go. Come go on, on, go, 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 go. Let's oh, go. Come on, Wait, babe. what? What? Come on, Matrix, go, get him. I'm trying. What the heck is happening? What Wait, is why am I so on? slow? Wait, oh, there we go. There we go. There's my Bugatti. There's that okay, W16. Okay. Get out of here. Let's go. There we go. I was a little worried there. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh, shoot, dude, yo. Oh, is he okay? Bro, are you good? Are you good? He says, uh, oh, dude, he might have wrecked his Ferrari. Oh, no. Can we push it out or something? He says, I think I'm stuck. Did you wreck it? Let me just say, did you wreck it? Oh, this does not look very good for him right now. Oh, no. He says, I don't know. Oh, he's really stuck here. Oh, shoot. Oh, no, that's not good. He's stuck for sure. I was like, I thought you said this thing was quick. What the heck, man? You let up all this hype, barely beat my girlfriend, and yeah, you got smoked by me. He said it owned your Bugatti at the first. Well, I mean, he did have you off the line for a little bit, but once yours kicked in... That's what I mean. I'm like, it doesn't really matter at the end, though. That's true. Yeah, he's just walking off. I'm like, sorry about your car, bro. Oh, he's like, shut up. Oh, what the heck? Ooh, okay, I think we're making him mad now. We yeah, whatever, man. Go. All right, let's get out of here. He's like, I hate you. Whoa, why is he all of a sudden so, like, angry with me? What the heck? I don't even think I can get out of here, to be honest. Really? Well, look how high this curb is. I'm gonna smash my Bugatti up trying to get out of here. Oh, no. I'm gonna walk home, he says. Oh, here we go. I think there's a ledge here. Yeah, I can get out. I'm like, you sure you don't want to drive home? And he's like, yeah, I don't want to drive home. It's only a five-hour walk. I'm like, are you sure, buddy? This is your last chance. This car is pretty quick. He says, okay, then, I guess. All right, he's going to hop in. All right, Lotus, get into your Audi. Okay. He says, let's see how quick this thing is, Slowpoke. I'm like, all right, tell me where your home is. Yeah, let's go. I'll take him for a rip. What does he mean, Slowpoke, by the way? Oh, shoot, Lotus, he lives in the same apartments as us. Oh, what? No way. I said we live there too, that's crazy. I've never seen that car in the parking lot though. I was like, we've never seen your car there, bro. He's like, I just moved there like three days ago. He's oh, like, cool. I used to live in Greenville. Oh, what the heck? Yo, we used to live in Greenville. Oh, you should see if he knows that Karen. I said this chick named Karen almost killed us there though, so we left. And he's like, hey man, sorry about earlier. I'm like, no problem, bro. We actually seems cool. And he's like, what about we meet up one day doing something? 100% man, sounds good to me let's do it okay this guy's actually pretty chill at first i was kind of worried and he's like nice dude but he's actually being like a really friendly guy so maybe we can like do some car meets and stuff with him heck yeah all right let's go drop him off lotus okay sounds good and he's like hey first friend in florida i mean technically same here right yeah i guess so and he's like nice he says this thing is actually pretty quick dude I was like, so is your car. Dude, I was honestly shocked. And he's like, thanks, man. All right, let's drop him off. I'm gonna say, all right, bro, see you later. All right, dude, nice to meet you. He says, all right, no problem. Thanks for the ride. Same, bro. He's all right, so later, nice. dude. He was pretty cool, eh? Yeah, I think so. So as you guys saw with Mashfee's story, he and I didn't start off being friends, actually. Things were kind of rough at the beginning with him. But over time, we realized that we're not so different and we're actually like really, really relatable. So we ended up becoming really good friends after kind of a weird start. And obviously, Lotus was there with us, my girlfriend, and she actually thought he was a really cool guy. So over some time, me and Mashfee became extremely close and I'm really grateful to have him as a friend as well because Mashfi is a lot different than Sammy. Sammy is a very reasonable and calm guy whereas Mashfi likes to take things to the extreme. Mashfi likes to make things interesting, test himself and try new things 
And that's what I think makes Mashvi a super fun friend to have. He definitely keeps things interesting and he definitely likes to change things up once in a while. So you never know what's going to happen when you spend a day with Mashvi. But we're going to move on and we're actually going to take a break from introducing friends. And I'm actually going to show you guys how Mashvi and Sammy met. So basically, Mashvi got into a really, really bad car accident. And we ended up coming up with the idea of surprising him with his own brand new car. And that really brought our friend group together. Me, Mashvi, and Sammy are now definitely bros. And yeah, this is how this story went. And I hope you guys enjoy. <sighs> Another day in Southwest Florida. Man, things have been so great recently. I finally got a good job. I'm making lots of money, but there's still one thing I can't stop thinking about, and that's my friend Mashfi. He recently got into a really bad car accident, and he lost his favorite car of all time. I promised him I would do something, so I'm gonna go see him, and I'm gonna go talk to him. So, let's see. I'm gonna ring his doorbell. Hello, Mashfi. You there, bro? Oh, wait, he's there. Yo, what's up, man? He says, oh, hi, Matrix. What's up? He says, come in, bro. All right, I'm, I'm gonna come in. I'm gonna talk to him real quick. I'm gonna say, yo, how you been since the accident, bro? And he's like, uh, I'm all right, man. I've not really been up to much recently. I miss my car, man. I know, dude. I'm gonna say, do you want to come with me, bro? Here's the thing. I actually already made an appointment at the dealership that I work at, so I'm gonna bring Mashvi and I'm about to surprise him with something crazy. I'm gonna say, otherwise, you've been okay, bro? Everything all right since your surgery? He says, yeah, man, everything's all right. I'm like, okay, sweet. I know for a fact he's been depressed. I can just tell. You know, when a guy loses his favorite car, he's never gonna be the same. So the plan today is I'm actually gonna be buying him a brand new dream car one of his favorite cars it's not a ferrari but you guys can take a guess at what you think it is i said let's go bro i got a surprise for you and he says nice mclaren man Ooh, i'm gonna say i hope you're ready bro let's go let's go let's go dude i'm so excited i can't believe i'm able to do this now he says you know that my dream car is a mclaren i know dude we've talked about it 650 s spider oh Okay, perfect. Now I know what car to go shopping for. Yes, I can't believe he just told me that. I'm just gonna say, oh, that's interesting. <laughs> I don't want to give anything away about today. And he's like, yeah. He said, mine is pretty cool too. Yeah, mine's just a 570. It's not as fancy, but I'm gonna tell him I appreciate it. Oh, and by the way, bro, I recently got a new job. And he says, wow. He's like, wow, what is it, man? It's actually at a dealer. I'll bring you there and show it to you. And he says, oh, all right, sounds good. He says, I think my surprise is going to be test driving a new cool car. Yo, how did you know? How did he know? He doesn't know I'm buying it for him though, so it's still gonna be a surprise. He says, it is? I said, you guessed it, buddy. You can test whatever you want. He's like, really? Bro, I wanna test my dream car. And I'm like, yes, including a 650. I said, you deserve this, bro. And he says, thank you so much, man. Oh, he's so grateful. And he doesn't even know that I'm actually going to be buying him the car. He's grateful just to drive it. That's how you know he's a good guy. And here we are, bro. Yep, this is it. My new workplace. I'm going to tell him I've been working here for a long time. I said, I'm actually really close with the owner, too. Do you want to meet him? And he's like, oh, of course. All right, man, let's go in and let's go meet him. Oh, shoot, yo, Sammy's right there. And wait, I, I know that guy. I swear I sold a car to him before. Oh, anyways, Sammy, yo. I said, yo, how you doing, dude? He's like, hey, what's up, dude? I said, this is my friend Mashfi. He says, I'm doing great, thanks, how are you? Oh, hey, Mashfi. And Mashfi says, hello, man. He says, pleasure to meet you. I'm gonna say, Mashfi actually recently lost his Ferrari. And Sammy's like, oh, dang. What happened, buddy? Yeah, I was in a big crash. And he's like, what? He's like, are you okay? And he's like, kinda. I'm gonna say, Mashfi doesn't have a car now, unfortunately. He's like, why don't you guys have a seat? Uh, sure. He's like, I'll get you some water. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. He's like, that guy is kind, man. I'm just gonna say, yeah, he's a super nice guy. Oh, shoot, yo! He, this guy says, oh, hi, sir, I remember you. Wait a second, didn't I sell you a car? I'm just gonna say, are you working here now? That's crazy. Nice, dude. Oh, Sammy's giving us some waters. Yo, thanks, Sammy. I'm gonna say, hey, Sammy, can I talk to you? I'm gonna say, Mashfi, I'll be right back, bro. All right, Sammy, come with me for a sec, man. I gotta, I gotta talk to you for a sec. Yo, Sammy, I have a plan, dude. 
I'm gonna say, so, Mashfi is a good friend of mine. I said, I really want to do something nice for him. I said, his dream car is a 650S McLaren Spider. You know, Sammy's always here for you, my good friend. Hey, I appreciate that, bro. He's like, we actually have a few 650Ss in the back. And I was like, right, so I'm gonna use the bonus you gave me to buy the one we have. He's like, we've got different colors and models. I said, but what we're gonna do, but I said, let's act like we're gonna just let him drive it and test it. But then after we're gonna surprise him and say it's his. And he's like, ah, okay, that's so nice of you, man. Okay, sounds good, dude. All right, you ready, bro? He's like, yup. Okay, let's go back and let's go talk to him. Yo, Mashfi. And then wait, Mashfi's like, yo, Matrix, look what I found outside. Oh, wait, okay, let's go see. Let's go see. Oh, he's probably gonna say Sammy's one to one. Oh, wait. There's one of the 650s Sammy has. Okay, wait. Uh, Sammy's like, hey, yo, this literally matches Mashfi. And Sammy's like, McLaren 650S Spider. It has custom rims included. And then Mashfi's like, I wish I had one. This would be so cool. Oh, wait, Sammy's talking to Mashfi. He says, okay, so this has got a twin turbo V8 in this bad boy. I'm gonna say to Sammy, I think we can let Mashfi drive this one, eh, Sammy? And then Mashfi's like, what? Really, bro? And then Sammy's like, yeah, of course, man. It's a beast. Mashfi's like, thanks, man. All right, all right. I offer free test drives. Let's go. Yo, he's already in it. <laughs> and he started it up too. All right, yo, how does it sound? Yo, look at the spider drop top. This is so nice. And he's like, wow, it sounds so good, dude. I'm gonna say, I love the spider version. This thing is awesome. And then he's like, rev this baby up, Mashfi. Let's hear it. Hey, there we go, dude. This is so sick. Hey, Sammy, can I hop in the passenger with Mashfi? He's like, of course you can, man. And then Sammy's like, all right, I'll wait for you guys outside. I'm like, all right, we won't be too long, dude. Y'all have five minutes for free. Enjoy. All right, man, let's go. We'll be right back, Sammy. Oh, here we go, dude. Yo, this car is perfect for Mashfi. This thing literally matches him perfectly. He's got to get one of these. This has got to be the car. This is it. I literally said, yo, you need one of these. You got to get one. And he's like, for real, bro, I wish. Dude, let's go rip this thing, man. <laughs> oh, wait, I got a text from uh, Sammy. Let me see what it says. Hey, bro, is he enjoying it? I said, he loves it, man. I said, let me send you the money and I'm gonna get this thing paid. And he says, okay, bro. All right. Yo, he's loving this thing. <laughs> All right, let's head back, my friend. I'm gonna say, I got one more surprise for you. And he's like, oh, question mark. Yo, this thing sounds insane too. Oh, snap. I love the turbo and the V8. Oh, he's putting the top back up too. Nice. Oh, there's Sammy. Okay, Sammy's there. Oh, there's Sammy. Yo, Sammy, we're back. Okay, so Mashfi, I gotta tell you something, man. And he's like, this thing is a beast, bro. And then uh, Sammy's like, yep, you're actually a very good driver. I saw you go full scent and controlled it very well. This car suits you, my friend. All right, I'm gonna say, so I've known you for a while, Mashfi. And ever since working with Sammy, I've been able to save up a little bit of money. And he's like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's so excited. And here's the thing. And he's just like, dude, he's so like nervous. I'm like, I want to give back to you for being such a good friend. I said, the keys you have for this McLaren, keys. These are your keys, bro. And he's like, wait, wait, what? I said, yo, this is yours now. You can keep it. He's like, no, no, I can't take that, bro. And he's like, no, man, that's too much money. And I'm like, dude, you have to take it. Don't worry. Sammy helped pitch in and we got you this. And he's like, wow, man. He's like, I have Matrix a great discount since he's a loyal employee. He's like, thank you guys so much. I'm like, yeah, man, this is all yours. You have to take it. And he's like, congrats, Mashfi. Yo, <laughs> he's so happy now. He's like, Matrix, I will never forget this moment, bro. He's like, I will take good care of this. And I'm like, me neither, man. I will never forget this. I'm so happy my friends are here to celebrate this. I said, this is what making money is all about. Giving back to your friends. And he's like, I'm happy for you guys. And he's like, thank you guys so much. Oh, he's sobbing in happiness. Oh, man. No problem, bro. It's all yours. And then Sammy's like, well, enjoy your new ride, man. Anytime. I'm like, should we take her home? And he's like, thank you so much. Yeah, man. And then Sammy's like, of course, just sign some paperwork. I'm gonna say, of course, let's do it. Let's do it. He says, come to my office, guys. All right, let's go. He says, okay. Oh, he printed out the paperwork. And then, and then Mashfi's like, thank you so much, Matrix. I got the check right here, Sammy. And then Sammy's like, so Mashfi, I actually have a discount to Matrix. Thanks, buddy. 
Matrix, I will pay you back someday, I swear. I said, we're friends, we've got each other. And then Sammy's like, uh, because it has custom rooms and it's a spider, uh, the original price was 160. Oh, wow, yeah, it's really not that expensive. But because Matrix has been so committed into his work and is such a great friend and employee, I am giving him a whopping $10,000 discount. Thank you, bro. I said, that really helps. Let's sign all his paperwork and get out of here. All right, Mashfi signed it and I signed it. All right, let's get the heck out of here. All right, Sammy, I'll see you later, bro. Oh, here we go, bringing the top down. Take care, my friend, will do. All right, man, let's go. So as you guys could see, Sammy and Mashfi became really, really close from that episode. And you know what? I'm really glad because we all get along very well. But this next friend, we did not start off as friends. And actually, he got us in a lot of trouble. So this friend, Friendship took some very long time to build up. He got us in some trouble. He really was extremely mean. Uh, you guys just gotta watch this one and tell me what you think. Could you even believe that one day we would become friends? It's crazy to me, but we did and this is how it all started with my friend Peeps. Ah oh, man, I'm so freaking bored. I got nothing to play on my computer. Oh wait, Sammy texted me. Yo, finally. Okay, let's see what's going on today. I'm so excited to do something. What did he say? He says, good morning, Matrix. How's it going, dude? I'm gonna say, I'm so bored, dude, but how you doing? He says, oh, I'm good, thanks. However, I'm kind of bored as well, lol. He's like, you want to come to my place? I'm gonna say, okay, no problem. He's like, we can meet up and maybe get a coffee. I'm like, sure, dude, that sounds great. I'll be there soon. He says, sounds good. All right, cool, cool, cool. Man, even Mashfi's been busy recently. I don't even know what he's up to nowadays. I was trying to get a hold of him earlier. And Lotus is busy with work. There's just not much going on right now. So at least I got my boy Sammy. We can go see him and see how he's doing. All right, here we are at Sammy's place. Dude, every time I pull up to this place, all I could think about is getting rich someday. But anyways, let's go see him. Oh, wait, there he is. <laughs> he didn't even see me. Hold on. Let me ring the doorbell. Yo, Sammy. Yo, you here, bro? Oh, wait, there he is. He's like, oh, I hear a car. I wonder who that could be. Yo, it's me, bro. What's up? Open up, bro. Why are we talking through the door, man? He's like, yo, what's good? Come in, my friend. All right, all right. Let me get in there. Yo, what's up? Man, it is nice to see you today, dude. I have been so freaking bored. And he's like, same here. Oh, wait, what did he say? Yeah, since the incident with Mashfi. I'm like, dude, I haven't seen Mashfi since we broke him out of the police station. I said, I hope he's doing good. Have you heard from him, man? He's like, he's like, I'm glad I have you here, man. You're one of my best friends ever. Dude, same here, bro. I just, I hope Mashvi's doing well. He's like, maybe he just needs a little break. He was quite traumatized from the event. So you want to go get some coffee now, bro? And he's like, but I'm glad to have you here. And he's like, yeah, of course. All right, let's go. I'm going to say it's just like old times, eh, Sammy, when we first met each other. <laughs> And he's like, yeah, man. He's like, what a throwback. I'm like, dude, I can't believe that's how we met. So what car are you bringing today, bro? And he's like, I'm still loving your LFA, bro. I'm like, yeah, same here, man. This thing's sick. And he's like, oh, I'm glad you asked. Oh, snap. Okay, he's probably going to show me something different. Let me move my LFA out of the way. Oh my gosh, that's why I love hanging out with Sammy. He's always got a different ride every single day. He's like, just purchased this. Behold, let's do a reveal. Oh, snap. Here we go. Let's see his new ride. He's like, this is my supercharged, fully built, 2,000 horsepower Viper. Yo, what? Yo, this thing sounds insane, bro. Oh, dude, this thing is sick. I love the color. It's actually a really nice spec. Red, black, and gray with the white rims. This is sick, dude. All right, here we go. Finally heading off LFA. Dodge Viper ACR. Let's go, dude. Yo, Sammy, should we do a quick race, bro? And he's like, yeah, sure. Let's do a rolling race. Oh, snap, dude. I'm not good at those. He wants to do it from 30 roll. All right, let's go up to 30. All right, we're gonna do it from 30. Let's go. Oh, dude. Let's freaking go. The LFA got a huge lead right there. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no, dude. Yo. Okay, that's insane, bro. What? And he's just laughing, bro. He knew he had me the whole dang time, man. 
And he's like, but once the supercharger pistons and that engine power kicks in, it's a beast, bro. And I'm like, yeah, yeah. All right, let's go get some coffee, dude. Oh, man, this is such a throwback. Also, whose McLaren is that? What the heck? That's pretty nice, actually. I haven't seen a black one out here. I just told him, I'm like, man, what a throwback. Yo, do you recognize this McLaren, by the way, dude? I don't think I've seen this one around town before. And he's like, nope. And he's like, it looks nice, though. I'm like, yeah, it does. It's just interesting. I've never seen this one before. And he's like, black and gold. Yeah, that's a good spec. All right, let's go in and get some coffee, dude. Man, it's so nostalgic to be here. And whoa, what is this guy doing on the counter? Wait, what's he saying? Uh, I don't think I need to make myself more clear than I already have. Give me my order. Yo, Sammy, who the heck is this guy? And he's like, I ordered it on the app. Oh, shoot, I gotta order mine on the app, too. Okay, there we go. Got my coffee. Uh, and why is there nobody even here? Wait a sec, yo, who are you talking to? And he's like, hey, you okay, man? Whoa, chill. And he's like, can I help you? And then Sammy's like, yeah, man. And he's like, I suppose you brokies now. And he's like, what did I say to you? I just asked if you're okay, dude. What's your problem? Oh, God, is Sammy picking a fight with this guy right now? Yo, what's this guy's deal, Sammy? And he's like, my friend, you gotta tell him how much cars I own. Bro, you don't gotta flex to this teenager, Sammy. He doesn't gotta know how rich you are, man. Come on. And he's like, yeah, you're right. Okay, I won't. I'm gonna save it. Yeah, you don't gotta you don't gotta be that way, man. And then he's like, do you know who my father is? And then Sammy's like, who's your father, bro? <laughs> Sammy would probably know them if they're rich, too, just because he's so well-connected. All right, let's see. Sammy's literally on his, like, gold-plated iPhone just ordering his coffee. <laughs> and he's like, whoops, that slipped out. Oh, wait, what? Orders two coffees online. Hey, he's getting me a coffee. Yo, thanks, man. I appreciate that. And this guy's like, where is my order already? He's like, collect it from the back. I, I'll do that, man. I got it. Let me just tell this guy, yo, did you order your drinks on the app or what, man? Also, what's with his legs, bro? Yo, that don't look right at all. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Hope you like waiting. And then Sammy's like, yeah, let's go, dude. All right, let's get the heck out of here. What the frick is wrong with that guy? <laughs> He's just gonna stand there and keep waiting. He's like, we can have our drinks outside. Wait, what did he say? Hold on. He said, I bet you like waiting with your slow car behind people like me. Bro, you don't even know what cars we have. Wh what did, where did that come from? He's like, you heard me. And he's like, what are you talking about, man? Bro, how is this guy? He's like, I know just by looking at you. Prius? Bro, what? He's saying I drive a Prius? Are you kidding me? And Toyota Camry. Bro. Sammy's like, that's so judgmental. What do you think, Matrix? I'm like, bro, why do I have to have the dang Prius? And why the Camry for me? Because you look like you need to save on gas, pal. Dang, bro. Okay, that, that was rude as heck, man. Sammy's like, sure. Matrix, let's just go. I'm like, lol, Sammy. This guy has no idea. And he says, because you wish you were fast. And then Sammy's like, this guy is so horrible. For real, man. All right, let's get out of here. You know what's funny? I bet this 570S is his too, man. And he's like, yeah, same, bro. Let's just go for a cruise, though. He's like, it's a typical rich teenage starter car. I'm like, dude, it's a nice car, but he's acting like it's the fastest car ever, which it's not. It's good. It's quick. But come on, man. And he's like, for real. He's like, it's just a lower end supercar. I'm like, this guy has no idea that we'd smoke him in a race. The Lexus LFA is actually worth a lot more than the 570 and a stock Viper. I'm like, true that, bro. All right, let's get out of here, man. All right, Sammy, let's roll. Let's go for a Wait, who's honking? What the heck? Yo, 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 Sammy, it's the kid from the coffee shop. What is he doing here? Yo, get out of here, bro. Hold on, let me get over to the other lane. What is going on, dude? He's like, oh, dang, let's pull over. And this guy's like, get out of my way. Yo, he just pushed me out of the way, dude. Is my car okay? All right, it looks all right. But dude, this kid just pushed me out of the way. He's like, slow cars. And he's like, yo, he almost crashed into me, bro. Wow. Yo, chill, dude. What the frick, man? You almost broke our cars. And he's like, you guys, great. He's like, I can't believe the way I let you treat me in the coffee store. You better put your money where your mouth is. Yo, what are you talking about, bro? You dumb brokies. Does this guy not know how expensive our cars are? He's like, how about we have a little race if you think my car is so slow? We never said it was slow, dude. He's like, I heard you talking about me, bro. And then Sammy's like, yo, we didn't say your car is slow, man, but sure, let's race. All right, if Sammy says so, let's do it then, I guess. He's like, you guys can't even drive. I almost rammed right into you. All right, kid, when you lose to us, you better just leave us alone after. And he's like, all right, let's go. He's like, I won't lose to you. LOL. 
Okay, he's like, on my seventh honk? Wait, what? He wants to do seven? Oh, he's already going. Oh, shoot. Wait, what? Oh, what the heck, dude? He was, like, honking, like, a hundred times, bro. Come on, Sammy. Come on, Sammy. Dude, this guy straight up is cheating right now. He honked, like, a hundred times. How are we supposed to know which one it was? Oh, Sammy's picking up. Yo, that Viper is so fast. Whoa! The kid came out of his car. Yo, why is the car over there? Bro, what is going on? The kid's not even in the car. Yo, hold on, Sammy. Did he jump out? What the heck did that kid do? He's like trying to run back to his car. You see him? Oh, now he's running towards us. Oh, great. Yo, is he okay? That looked freaking awful. He was going so fast when he jumped out. Wait, the kid's okay. He's like, you get back here right now. Wait, what? Is he actually okay? Yo, chill. Oh, Sammy almost hit him. Yo, are you okay, man? And he's like, oh, you had better hope you have good insurance. Bro, this guy's really talking about money and insurance right now. Dude, are you all right? Like, and then even Sammy's like, hey, you okay, man? I'm not the one that you should be worried about. What the? Okay. And then he's like, dude, your car went flying. He's like, because of you fools. Oh, he's like going on his phone. What is he saying on his phone? What the? And then Sammy's like, what's that supposed to mean? I'm calling my father because of you fools. And then Sammy's like, oh no. These two hooligans hit your car. Oh my god, it wasn't even his car! Bro, it's not even yours! And he's like, and now it's ruined. It's all their fault. Dude, you're joking with me right now. You're kidding me. He's like crying. He's like, what am I supposed to do? Wait a second. This kid is literally acting so tough and now he's crying in front of his own dad, bro. What the heck? Yo, why do you call him daddy, bro? That's so childish. What the heck? And he's like, whatever he said got tagged. He's probably like, I love you or something. He's like, I'll see you soon, dad. Bye. Yo. And then Sammy's like, for real, Matrix, like at this day and age? And he's like, you two. Oh, great. Now he's gonna act all tough again. He's like, I want your information now. Bro, we just saw you crying in front of your dad. You don't scare us. You can stop acting like that now. You can stop acting like that. He's like, I'm not done with you yet. And then Sam is like, why are you lying to your dad? You didn't tell him that you crashed it yourself. That's true, man. And then he's like, you're going to be crying in front of a judge. Bro, we didn't do anything wrong, man. I said, we literally didn't touch your car, bro. It's two against one here. And he's like, now help me find it or else. Yo, he's got a gun. Sammy, yo, 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 yo. He's got a gun, bro. Chill, chill, chill. Yo, he's shooting. He's shooting everything. Yo, now it's two against two, he said. He's like, everybody freeze. Oh, God. All right, tough guy, chill. All right, relax. We'll get you your car back. He's like, stop moving. Here's what's gonna happen. You're gonna help me find my car. And Sam's like, why, dude? No. And he's like, and we're gonna get it fixed. All right, man, fine. Look, dude, it's all good. We'll help you. Just put the gun away. And Sam's like, fine, whatever. Come on, dude, let's help him. And he's like, and this will all look like a little accident that you caused, okay? Sure, dude, sure, sure. All right. Okay, he put the gun away. He's like, all right, follow me. Bro, what the frick? This guy just got crazy. This guy just went straight up crazy. Where did he get that gun from? Yo, Sammy, bro, we should just run, man. Let's get out of here. I said, I'm not going to be paying for his own mistakes, bro. And he's like, yeah, let's go. Shh, hurry. Oh, wait, the guy's like, where did they go? Yo, run, 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 run. Dude, we got to go. We got to go. Oh, he's going to come out of there any second. Bro, run, run, run. We got to get out of here, man. Where is he? Where is he? I think the kid's like stuck in there somewhere. Oh, he's right there. Yo, run. Get out of here, Sammy. What the frick? Yo, he just pulled out of nowhere. He just pulled out of nowhere. We got to get out of here now, bro. He's like, where do you think you're going? Sammy, come on, bro. We got to go. We got to get out of here immediately. What the heck? Sammy's like, oh no, my car. So as you guys just saw in that episode, Peeps and I did not get along. And in fact, even Sammy did not like him. And Sammy likes everybody. So it's crazy that he was so unlikable, even Sammy didn't like Peeps. But over time though, things do improve. And you guys will see in this video, a totally different side of Peeps. He's not exactly the guy we thought he was. He just has a lot going on. And uh, you guys got to get to know him in order to find that out. So watch this next one. And you'll see a side of peeps you didn't expect. So let's get into it. Ah, Lotus, doesn't it feel good to be back in Southwest Florida again? Yes, that place was insane, and I hope we never go back there ever again. Honestly, I'm surprised we didn't get killed, <laughs> to be honest. Yeah, we were pretty close, though. You shot somebody. 
I thought we were gonna get arrested, go to jail. You know what? We should probably tell somebody about that. We should go see if Sammy's uh, free and then just go hang out and tell him all about what happened. Yeah, and make sure he never goes to Liberty County or that anyone ever does. All right, let's go see Sammy and uh, yeah, let's give him the warning and the heads up. All right, Lotus, let's see if Sammy's here because we got to go tell him about what happened. Please, go park. Okay. Oh, wait. Uh, what? Whoa, look at that blue car. Is that something new that he just got? I don't recognize that, but I know his Conan seg was also a similar blue, so that might be Sammy's new ride. That's pretty nice, actually. Porsche 918 that's Spider. That's cool. Should we go check it out? Of course. I don't think he'd mind. Whoa, yeah. look at this thing. That's nice. Okay, honestly, I... What? Wait a sec. Who the heck is this? Oh, he says, oh. hey! Uh, wait. Oh, no. Uh, Lotus, I know this guy. What? Yeah, he says, what are you doing near my car? I'm just gonna say, hey, dude, we're just stopping by and saw it. Nice ride, by the way. I think I know you. And he's like, thanks, dot, dot. Wow, uh, that is a pretty nice wait. ride. What? Wait, Matrix, look. I'm what? like... Yo, bro, you skipping leg day? Look at his <laughs> Yo, those are some weird looking <laughs> legs, man. <laughs> He's like, where have I seen you before? He's like, excuse me? Hey, get yo girl in line, fool. <laughs> yo, I mean, is All right, she, hey, whatever. I mean, is she wrong though, dude? <laughs> yo, that man's feet are like size one. <laughs> what the heck? I'm gonna call him chicken legs. It's not even the <laughs> legs, Lotus. What's with those dainty feet? <laughs> That's what I mean. What are those? What on earth is this? You. You totaled my car. Oh, I remember completely now. So, Lotus, me and uh, this guy, we ran into each other with Sammy. Let me just say to him, I did not total your car, dude. And he's like, and I still have not gotten insurance information. Basically, we ran into this rich kid, right? And mm -hmm. what happened was uh, he wanted a race. Then he smashed his own car and blamed us for it. Yeah, it looks like something he would do. Right? He's like, also, I'm working on my body, okay? I'm not very confident. I'm gonna say, well, you seem like you are with the way you talk to others, dude. This guy was the most egotistical guy ever last time we met him. And he's like, well, you still seem like a brokey, so... See, see what, what I mean? mean? And he's like, is that car even yours? And I'm like, well, we got things to do, bro. And I'm gonna say, yes, I just bought this too. And he's like, or was it lent to you by that slow, dumb friend? Lotus, he's literally talking about Sammy right now. What? I literally was like, you mean Sammy? The guy who owns this whole dealership and who your dad buys his cars from? And he's like, that guy who rented the supercar. So I wouldn't think he drove a Camry. Oh my god. This guy's made a oh whole story in his head of goodness. Sammy. Also, I just checked with the front desk. They said Sammy's out today. It's his day off. Yeah, Lotus, I think we might just have to go home. And he's like, I bet your pea brain would think that's funny. Oh my god. This dude's so rude. And he's like, and why don't you tell me something? And he's like, how would you know? You haven't even raced me. Then you know what? Oh, God. What are you about to say, Lotus? Matrix is going to race you. Oh, wait. What? Why are you speaking on my behalf? Because your car's faster. I mean, look at it. Uh, and he's like, I know. And are you going to give me my insurance money? Bro, you literally crashed it yourself. How are we still talking about this? And then he says, well, if you're not going to do that, then let's make this interesting, shall we? Uh, what are you saying? Okay, let's see. What the heck is this guy trying to talk about? I don't owe him insurance money, by the way, Lotus. He's just making that up. Yeah, I know. He's like, I bet my car is faster than yours, and I'll bet my pink slip on it. Wait, what? He's betting his entire title and registration on this? You mean his dad's entire title and registration? Honestly, you're probably right, Lotus, but yo, what the heck are you talking about? He's like, why? Are you scared? Chicken what? boy. So you want to bet your car against me? Am I getting this straight? Okay, let's just see what happens if he were to win here. He's like, nobody asked you. Oh, snap. He's like, unless you're afraid. I'm so confused. This guy literally wants to bet his car in a race. He's like, I get your car. Let me say, how much was this anyways, dude? How much did you even spend here? Because I spent 1.2 million on mine. So he's like, come on, Tiny Tim, man up, bro. What the heck? He's Dang. like, I spent 1.3. Okay, that's pretty close to the value of mine. I don't know, Lotus. I don't know if this is a good idea. I just bought this hypercar. Uh, jeez. Okay, wait, let me ask him. Is yours 
stock okay let me see if his is stock first before i make some sort of bet like that and he's like i have a stage one turbo and engine upgrade you know what honestly just to put this kid in his place i'm gonna go ahead and do this race let's do it i'm honestly sick of this guy but if i win the car you can't blame me for anything all right lotus you're the witness Yep, I hear you. I'm going to say that to him too. Lotus is the witness. You can't blame me for anything. And he's like, well, if I win your car, don't come crying for more money. I don't need your dad's money, bro. Okay, you can keep that stuff. And he's like, meet me at Starblocks. Oh, wait, what? Okay, I guess. I don't know why we have to go back there again. But yeah, Lotus, this dude is crazy. And last time we did a race with him. All right, Lotus, here we are at Starblocks. I don't know why he wanted to meet here to do a race, but let's go see if he's even here yet. Maybe uh, he needs his like pumpkin spice latte before he starts or something. I don't know what this kid's thinking. So why are we here? Let me say. And he's like, wow, I knew you were slow, but not that slow. Bro, come on, man. Why are we here? What are we doing? Just here to keep talking or are we gonna race? He's like, nice body upgrade to your Prius, by the way. So the wager is set. I'm just gonna say yes. Okay, I'm gonna say Lotus will hold both slips while we race. And he's like, shakes hand. All right, so I'll shake his hand back too. And then I'll hand you my pink slip. Okay, so he's given you his and I've given you mine. So you've got both, but don't, don't come in my car, all right? We're just gonna, you're gonna watch the race. Yep. I'm gonna go wait at the intersection. Okay, be careful and just wait there and then you'll do the countdown for us, okay? Okay, sounds good. He says, we race to the other side of town. All right, let me just agree with him. Let's do it. Oh my God, he just hopped ah! the curb. Yo! He almost hit me with his car. Hold up, hold up. Let me just say to him, don't damage my new car, okay? I, mean, I don't really want it to come with any body scratches. He says, your new car, you better believe it, bro. He's like, fat chance, tiny Tim. Yo, why does he <laughs> keep he call calling me that? Why does he keep calling me Tim? I don't know. <laughs> all right, on three, I'm going to count down, all right? All right, I'm ready. Let's do this thing. Or on go, I should say, actually. Yeah, yeah, all right. All right, ready? Yep. Three, two, one, go! Oh, let's go! Come on. Go, oh. Go, 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 go. oh, this is close. This is actually a lot closer than I thought it would be. Come on. Come on, McLaren. Come on. Oh, it's so close. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're neck and neck right now. Just got to keep pushing. Let's go. Active arrow is definitely helping right here. Trying to get to the top speed. Holy smokes. I've got the lead, Lotus. I've got the lead. Go, go, go. Come on. Oh, yeah. I've got him. I've got him. Let's go. This thing is so fast. Let's go. I won. Yes. He's, like, he's like, no, there's just no way. This was my pride and joy. I'm like, let's go, dude. Yeah, I just made a million dollars in one race. That was awesome. I said, sorry for your luck, man, but this was your idea. We're all the way at the other side of, uh, of town, by the way. Oh, he's crying. Start sobbing. Oh, wait, he's on the phone with his dad. No, my God. He's oh, calling no. his dad right now. He's like, hello, dad. I just lost your car. It wasn't even his car. Oh, no. You're wait, kidding. You're wait, kidding. Wait, Matrix. Sh what? Should we, should we rethink this? He's like, yo, he's getting yelled at. Oh, I can literally hear him getting yelled at. And I'm like all the way over here. He says, I'm sorry, dad, please don't. And he's like, I, oh, I didn't mean to. Oh, he's getting yelled at hey, bad. Hey, come over here. Let's have a conversation real quick. He's like, I was going to win, dad. Wow, he's getting in so much trouble, Lotus. Ho, oh. ho, ho. I don't know. Like, should we take the car? Like, maybe we just, like, teach him a lesson and, and just let him have the car back. I don't want him to get in trouble. Like, and it's not even his, you know? I, I hear what you're saying, but this kid is so annoying. He says, oh, okay, I'll be home soon. Oh, I think his dad's going to, like, get really mad at him later. Oh, God. He's maybe like, I'm you really can, like, sorry. Maybe deal with him or something where, like, he just leaves you alone and, like... Like, whatever it is, like, just stops bugging you about the insurance and everything. Lotus, no. this kid was so rude. Like, oh, he's coming oh, over. He's hold coming, up. He's coming, hold he's up, coming. hold up. What does he want to say? He's like, I have to keep my word, though. Bye. He says, hi, guys. Okay, what's up? All right, let me just say, yeah, what's up, man? He's like, I have to give respect where respect is due. Okay. Yeah, thanks, I guess. 
He's like, you won fair and square. He's like, here are my keys. Oh, he gave me the keys. Okay, well, thanks. Uh, dude, your dad sounded pretty mad. Are you gonna be okay? I just want to see, like, because I feel a little bit bad right now. Yeah. He's like, he is, but money is just money to him. Okay, so he's, he's gonna, he's gonna financially recover from this. He said, he's more mad that I ran my <laughs> mouth. Oh, wow. Good point. Yeah, okay, I guess that makes sense. Which is why I have to say this. I'm sorry. I never thought this guy would apologize. He's like, I was not a nice person to you. And yeah, me neither. I was like, oh, wow, thanks, I guess. And he's like, and this was a big eye opener for me. Well, I guess I do have to say, I'm like, you know, I'm sorry as well for calling him chicken legs. That's good of you, Lotus, to do. And he's like, I'm going to work to be a better person. And he said, haha, it's okay. Wow, this guy's actually being really nice. I thought that conversation with his dad was going to make him more angry, but... He's actually being really, really nice right now. I'm just going to say to him, look, dude, I don't need your car. To be honest, it's not really even my style. You can yeah. have it back. I'm just going to give it back. Like, honestly, I'd rather earn my own cars anyways. So let me just say gives keys. I'm going to just give them back. Here you go, dude. You can take them back. Well, you know what? I think what's most important is that, like, I think you've both earned each other's respect here. And hey, maybe he can, like, be our friend now or something. Maybe. He says, oh my goodness, you're so nice, but now I feel even worse. I want to repay you. I said, honestly, dude, if you want to hang out with our friends and get to know us, that's good enough repayment for us, I think. And he's like, I'd be happy to. Okay, cool, man. He's like, also, Lotus has a point. We need to spread the love around, not hate. Let's do it. You know, what's wrong with having more friends? He's like, my name is Peeps, by the way. Good to meet you, man. He says, I can't wait to meet your friends. I said, I'm sure you'll get along with them, bro. They love cars too. I'm gonna say, do you want to go for a friendly cruise instead of like racing as if our lives depend on it? And he's like, I'd love that. All right, man, let's go for a cruise. And he's like, oh, and he says, I'm the vice president at FinTech. Oh, snap. Oh, no I was way. wondering who his dad was. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, wow. He's like, my father is the one that owns the company. Yo, that's pretty cool. He says, I think your friend might know him. I'm sure Sammy probably does. Yeah, it's possible. He's like, I was just trying to be discreet last time. I said, I'm sure Sammy would love to meet you then on better terms. He's like, I owe him an apology too. All right, let's go for a drive. Okay, okay, let's go. Sounds good. <laughs> So as you guys just saw, Peeps is actually a pretty decent guy once you get to know him. Overall, I think he still just has a lot of pressure on him, and it kind of makes it difficult to get to know him, but even me and Lotus managed to see a side of Peeps we didn't expect. And at the end of everything, we ended up being really good friends, and I'm looking forward to hanging out with him more and even introducing him to all of my other friends. But before we get into introducing him to everybody else, we're actually going to switch things up and we're going to go hang out with a couple of my other friends who invited invited me to go off-roading. Now, this didn't turn out the way I thought it was going to. You'll need to watch it. Things kind of got a little bit scary, but watch the video and see what happens in our off-roading adventure. Bro, I'm so glad that we settled our issues and our friends finally. And then he's like, I'm sorry I didn't give you the benefit of the doubt. It's all good, man. I said, same to you, and I hope you get to meet my other friends. I know we're all gonna get along super well. He's like, I can't wait, bro. Oh, shoot, wait, I just got a message from Mashfee. Wait, hold on a sec. Uh, one sec, bro, my friend just messaged me. Let me check this out real quick. He says, yo, bro, it's been a while. Why don't you come over to the Seaside Grill? I'm like, yo, Mashfee, I'm down, bro. I'm just at McDonald's right now. Would it be all right if I brought my friend with me? He's like, I have a friend of mine here that I could introduce you to. All right, sure, we can both introduce our friends. Sweet, let's do it, man. And he's like, and I have a surprise for you, dude. Oh, snap, really? Okay, yo, what? He's got a surprise for me? That's crazy. I said, we'll be there in a bit, bro. He's like, all right. I was like, yo, that was my friend Mashfee, by the way. He wants us to go to the Seaside Grill. He's like, yo, really? I've never been there before. I was like, apparently he's got a surprise for us too. I'm just gonna ask, like, are you down to join us, man? I said, he's a super chill guy. I think you'll get along with him. He's like, I don't think I've met him before. I said, yeah, I don't think you have, but don't worry, bro, he's awesome. And he's like, sweet, man, let's do it. All right, let's head out, let's go. This is gonna be sick. I'm actually so excited that my friends are gonna start to get to know each other. This is gonna be super cool. Yo, peeps, have you been working out or something, by the way? I'm gonna say you look taller or something. I can't really describe it. He's like, yeah, man, it's so cool being in this car. I've been on that bulk, wait, what? 
what really he's like i've been going to the gym too i'm like that's awesome bro i'm gonna say no more chicken legs eh he's like in a couple of weeks i'm gonna cut down my weight and he's like haha yeah yeah yo here we are by the way oh dude i really don't want to have my mclaren in here look at all the sand what the heck He's like, uh, one day we gotta get dinner. And he's like, whoa, check out these trucks. Yo, these things are sick. What the heck? Yo, these are freaking sick. Jeep Gladiator, Toyota Tacoma TRD. I said, I think my friends are inside if you're ready to go, man. Yo, he got so tall. What the heck? Oh, wait, yo, there's Mashfi. Yo, Matrix. How you been, dude? It's been forever. I said, yo, by the way, this is my friend Peeps. Sammy met him recently. Meet my friend Nurko. All right, let me say hi to Nurko. Yo, what's up, Nurko? I'm just gonna say how are you man hope you're doing well and then they're saying nice to meet you he's like hi dude how's it going guys should we grab a seat or something and he's like whoa you are tall yeah for real he's actually like what like seven feet tall <laughs> what's good matrix not much all right let's go follow mashvi i think he's got a table for us i said yo this place is nice i've never heard of it before and then mashvi's like for real dude so you said you had a surprise or something? And Mash was like, so how's life, bro? I said, I'm not doing bad, bro. We're chilling, you know? How about you? And he's like, yeah, I do have a surprise for you. He's like, yeah, we are all good. Nice, man. So me and Nurko are planning on taking y'all off-roading. Hold up, right now? Wait a second, Mashvi. Don't tell me those sick off-road trucks are yours. And he's like, don't worry, bro. Everything is on me. He's like, yep, the dark gold one is mine. What? Yo, and then Peeps is like, Matrix, I was just telling you about my truck. Dude, the blue one is mine. Oh, sick, Nurko. And then uh, I was like, yo, we should go look at the Matrix. Where is your truck? I said, oh, I can go home and get it real quick. He's like, oh, all right, sweet. All right, let's go check out your stuff first, and then I'll go grab mine. Yo, these are sick, bro. You guys got some sick off-road trucks. Oh, Peeps is like, yeah, that works, because I'll have to go and get mine, too. Okay, Peeps, I'll drop you off. Uh, guys, should we all meet at the off-road entrance? Uh, and then, uh, Nurko's like, sure. And then Mashvi's like, yes, sweet, sounds good. Okay, good, good, good. All right, guys, we'll meet you there. See you in a bit. Yo, those are some sick trucks. I can't even lie. Dang. Yo, peeps, you ready to go off-roading, bro? This is gonna be so sick. I'm gonna say, nice truck, by the way, man. That thing is awesome. And he just said, thanks, dude. All right, here we are. The boys are there already with their trucks. Yo, they look so good, man. I think I got the biggest truck here, which uh, isn't always a good thing for off-roading. Wait, what is Mashvi saying? He's like, here we are, guys. And then Mashvi's like, all right, make sure to be safe, dudes. All right, so who's gonna lead us off-roading? I'm guessing it's probably gonna be Mashvi. And then he's like, me, ah, I thought so. And he's like, whoa, this thing is banging. And he's like, right? I love it. Thanks, bro. He's like, anytime. Yo. I said, I feel like Nurko's Jeep is going to make this look so easy, but we'll have to see who's going to do the best here. I said, hopefully nobody gets stuck today. All right, Mashvi's going in first with the Toyota Tacoma, and then Nurko with the Jeep, and then I'll pull up with my uh, TRD Tundra. And then, of course, we've got Peeps in the Chevy truck. This is going to be so good. All right, let's go. I haven't done this off-road place in a while, so hopefully I don't mess anything up. Let's freaking go, dude. The boy's going off-roading today. I wish Sammy was here, um, but at least we got to do it with him last time. Yo, this is sick. I really love this place. It's so different to what we're used to doing regularly. So far, this is the easy part. We just gotta blast through this, and then it's gonna get way harder. Oh, wait, here's some water. Okay, we gotta... We gotta take this easy, because this is... Oh, jeez. Careful, Mashvi. Yo, he almost slid back into the water. Come on. All right, wait. Where's Peeps? Yo, Peeps! <laughs> I'm like, guys, wait for Peeps. Oh, my goodness. Yo, I think his truck's two-wheel drive. Yo, Peeps, are you just two-wheel drive, bro? <laughs> That's crazy, man. I mean, he's still doing a great job. Come on, Peeps, you got this, bro. I think he is two-wheel drive, because he can't get over that unless he, like, picks up a lot of speed. Oh, my gosh. Nice, bro. Nice. Nice job, guys. We're killing it right now. Let's keep going. Come on. Yo, look at this swamp area. This is so sick. All right, come on, Mashfi. You got this, bro. I believe in you. Come on, bro. Oh, dang, that's hard. Yo, I told you Nurka was gonna make this thing look easy. Come on, Mashvi. You got this, dude. This part's a little bit difficult. I can understand it. Come on, man. Oh, there you go. Nice, dude. Let's go. Nice job, man. All right, I'm gonna get up it very easily in the tundra. All right, come on. There you go, peeps. Yo. Oh, 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 dude, so close. I think it's because it's rear-wheel drive. It's, it's kind of difficult for him to pull up, but let's go. 
Hey, nice, dude. Just have to give it some gas. All right, I'm going to go through this feature here. Uh, this is pretty easy for my big truck. Uh, hopefully, peeps can get through it too. All right, this is the hardest feature left. Come on, guys. We got this. Oh, wait, look at Nurko go. Yo, Mashvi, chill, bro. Yo, Mashvi, be careful, bro. Yo, he's whipping through this thing. Yo, careful, careful. And then Nurko, of course, having no issue in the Jeep. Look at him go. He's like, I got this. I kind of hurt myself, though, but I got this. Come on, Mashvi. Yo, careful, bro, chill. Holy smokes, yo, what are you doing? Bro, be careful, dude. Yo, Peeps is like, dude, this looks intense. You got this, Peeps. I said, I'll go last. Come on, Mashfi. Oh, he's like stuck in there. What the heck? Yo, careful. Come on, Peeps. He's like, I just don't want to get in the way. Oh, I understand. Come on, Mashfi. Come on, Mashfi. All right, Peeps. Come on, bro. You got this. Uh, wait, what did he say? He's like, dude, did you see that? Wait, see what? Uh, yo, what the frick? Mashfi. Yo, Mashvi's screaming. Hold on, I gotta get out of my truck. Mashvi, bro. Yo, he's like, ow. Ah. Yo, Mashvi, bro. Are you good? What happened? What the heck? Peeps is like, are you okay? He's like, help. I can't get out. Oh, no. He's like, I flipped 40 times. Wait, what, dude? Yo, this thing looks busted. What did he do? He's like, I'm half dead. Ow. Guys, we need to get him out. Yo, this doesn't look good, guys. Dude, his door is stuck. We can't get him out. Oh, snap. Dude, his door is stuck. We can't get him out of here. And he can't even move the truck. He's like, bro, just stay there. Oh, shoot, dude. What should we do? Oh, dude, this wasn't supposed to happen. He's like, ow, ow. He's like, we need to get him out of the truck and transport him to the hospital. I'm like, for sure, man. How can we do that? He's like, ow, help. I'm upside down. Bro, wait, what? He's like, grab a rock. Okay, yeah, yeah. Someone grab a rock and smash the window. Okay, good idea. Um... I don't see any. And then Nurko's like, let me take him to the hospital. Hold on. Okay, wait. Wait, Nurko's gonna get something from his truck. My neck is broken. Does anybody have anything like a crowbar or something? And then wait, Peeps is like, okay, let me see if I can put my karate to the test. Punch his window. Yo. He's like, okay, that one hurt. One more. Come on. Come on, Peeps. Chop that door up. Wait, he broke the window. He's like, hey, man, we're here. Yo, Peeps, what the heck? How did you do that, bro? Okay, get him out, get him out. Come on, get him out, dude, get him out. He's like, I can reach the unlock. Come on, get him out, bro. Oh, Mashvi's like, ow, ow. Okay, he's in a lot of pain right now. This is not looking good. He's like, I can't move, bro. He's like, okay, Mashvi, I got you, bro. Come on, guys, let's get him in Nurko's truck. Guys, we need to pick him up. All right, I got you, bro, I got you. Okay, guys, put Mashvi in. Okay, Mashvi, you're gonna be okay, bro. He's like, ow, I'm gonna die. He's like, get in, y'all. All right, all right, all right. Let's hop in, let's hop in. I said, I'll follow you guys behind. Let's go, let's go. Oh, dude, this is not good. This is so bad. I can't believe my friend Mashvi got hurt. We shouldn't have done this. We should have been a lot more careful. This was not a good idea. Man, off-roading is a lot of fun, but it is so dangerous. But I know Mashvi's gonna be okay. I know he will be. Oh, wait, what did Peep say? It seems like you broke your ankle and your right arm in the crash. Mashvi's like, I'm dead, bro. Peeps is like, can you move your fingers? Mashvi's like, no. Peeps is like, you're not gonna die, bro. He's like, I'm gonna die, I swear. Ah, it hurts. Come on, Mashvi, you're gonna be all right, man. Mashvi's like, what about my truck? Peeps is like, does it hurt when I press here? Presses on forearm. Ow! Peeps is like, oh, okay, okay, okay. He said, it's definitely broken. You're gonna be okay. Okay, man, and your truck will be taken care of. Oh, man, I'm so worried about him. Peeps is literally offering to pay for all of the damages. That's crazy. Oh, man, my truck is gone. That thing turned into a mashed potato anyways. We can't fix it now, bro. He said, it's okay then. We'll get you a new one. He's like, I need a new one. Then Mashvi's like, no, dude, you don't need to. And then Peeps is like, please, I insist. It's the least I can do. And then Mashvi's like, well, I guess if you insist. Thanks, bro. But I'm dying. Okay, we're here. We're here. We're here. All right, I'm just going to leave my truck right there. He's like, now this is going to be tough. Oh, God, they got to move him. It's not going to look good. Nurko's like, come on, Mash. Oh, man, moving him is not going to be good. Is he doing okay? I, I can't really tell. I was in my truck. Oh, they're gonna grab him and put him in. Oh, they're slowly moving him inside. Come on, guys. Come on, everybody. Let's get Mashvi inside the room. Come on. Okay, bro. There you are. You're gonna be okay. He's like, ow. I said, it's gonna be okay, Mashvi. The doctors are coming, bro. It's gonna be all right. 
He's like, first my Ferrari, now my truck, bro. I said, dude, I know, but those are just things. We got to make sure that you're okay. And then Peeps is like, don't worry about that. And he's just so sad. Oh, it's okay, Mashvi. You're going to be all right. Well, as you guys saw, that did not turn out as planned. And Mashvi is currently in the hospital. I hope he's okay. We really need to check in on him because I worry about him. He's gone through a lot and he's been in so many freaking car accidents recently, but he is a tough guy. I'm sure he's going to be okay, but we really need to see how he's doing. Now, this next video really, really changes things and you have to watch it because things kind of went the wrong way and I'm kind of in a lot of trouble at the moment. So I shouldn't even be here in Florida right now. I should be gone, but long story short, guys, you need to watch this next video i'm so worried about peeps i'm so worried about mash fee and me and sammy have some really really big problems ahead so watch this next one and you'll see what i mean here we go man i'm so worried i hope we don't get in trouble wait is that a cop no oh shoot that was a cop and we're going 200 miles an hour careful man careful that was a cop bro no he's pulling in this is the police get out of the car now yo are you serious all this over a dang ticket he's like i hope you rot in jail Oh man, I've been in jail for three days. I freaking hate it here. My poop smells terrible. This thing is made out of freaking metal and I can't get any sleep because all I hear is people screaming. Let me out. I can't stand it in here anymore. Come on. Hello, somebody. Oh wait, there's a cop. Wait, she's like, time to go check on the prisoners. I'm gonna say, hey, let me out. I'm sick and tired of this crappy place. And she's like, hey, you, stop yelling. I said, let me go. I said, all I did was drive a little bit fast. Come on, this is not fair. And she says, keep it up and you'll be here for the next five days. Wait, what? No, come on. I said, is there anything I can do to get out of here? I really want to leave. And she's like, what are you even doing in here? Usually I get bummy crooks. Yeah, well, I'm not a bummy crook. Do I look like one? I said, do I look like a bummy crook to you? And she says, not someone like you, dot, dot, dot. Wait, what? What are you trying to say? What are you saying? And she says, I mean, you're kind of cute for a prisoner. Oh, heck no. What the heck? Yo, I said, yo, lady, that's inappropriate. What's wrong with you? And she says, don't be mean and maybe I'll let you out. Winky face. What the heck? Uh, okay. I mean, I, I just want to get out of here. I I'll try to be nice. I said, I'll be nice if that means I can escape. And she's like, you don't got a girlfriend, right? Wait a sec. I do have a girlfriend. I ain't gonna cheat on Lotus for this girl. Are you kidding me? So I'm gonna just say, uh, yeah, I have a girlfriend, lady. I said, but I'll be nice if you just let me out. Please, come on. I hate it here. Oh, yo, she's like, oh, come on. Don't you love a woman in uniform? Wait, what? No. All I said was, no, they've never been nice to me. Me. They're always rude and she's like, what did you say? I'm like, so can you please just be nice and let me go? I just want to go home. Is she like mad now or something? She's like, that's it. I'm leaving. No, wait, come on. Come on. You can't do that lady. She's like, you won't disrespect me. I'm like, just let me go. I'm sorry. Let me just say that. I'm sorry. She's like, stay in here. You criminal. Oh, come on. Now I'm all alone again. Wait, what? Where's Peeps? Ayo, hey, Peeps! You there, bro? Yo, hello! Wait, that's not Peeps? Wait a sec, is that Sammy? And that's Harvey! Yo, what are you guys doing here? When did you get here? And then, wait, Harvey's like, Matrix! Oh, he's helping me break out! Yo! And then, wait, Sammy's like, come on, we gotta go! Shush, be quiet! I said, yo, what the heck? How did you guys know I was in here? And he's like, bro, it's so good to see you. Man, same here. Oh, he's like, Mashfi told me. Oh, shoot. Yo, come on, bro. Let me out. Oh, no. She's coming. Wait, Sammy, run. Go. Don't get caught, bro. Run, bro. Run. He's like, where's the keys? I'm like, I don't know, bro. I don't know. Just go. Go. Come on, Harvey. Get out of here, bro. I'm like, don't get yourselves in trouble for me. Just get out of here. Yo, Sammy, you got me out. Dude, let's get the heck out of here, bro. Yo, I can't believe Sammy and Harvey came to bust me out of here. He's like, hurry, come on, let's go. Okay, okay. <gasps> it's the cop. Oh, shoot. She's right there. Sammy, run. Run, bro. Where are we? Come on. Oh, crap. Come on, Sammy, let's go. 
Come on, bro. Go, go, go. Where's our cars? Where's the car? Yo, seriously, bro. Where's your car? She's got a gun. Sammy, go. Oh, shoot. She's shooting. Come on, bro. He's like, hey, bro, I've got some cars over here. Then run. Yo, this is not good. This is not freaking good. Where's the cars? Wait, she's like, I'm coming for you. Oh, God. Come on, Sammy. I'm just going to run over here. Sammy, where are the cars, bro? We got to go. Where is she? Oh, shoot. Oh, wait. I see some cars over there. Is that it? He's like, over here, bro. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh, snap. Uh, which one do I take? Sammy, which one do I take? He's like, let's go, my friends. Uh, I, I guess I'll take the Type R. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Oh, she's there. Come on, Sammy. Let's go. She's right there. She's shooting our tires. Oh, crud. Come on, Sammy. Where's Harvey? Is he good too? Yeah, they're good. Let's go. Let's go. Bro, where are we going? What is the plan? Oh, crap. We have the whole entire police force after us now. This is so freaking bad. All the cops in all of Florida are going to be after us soon. Wait, where's Sammy? Oh, shoot, guys, let's run. She's right there. It's only a matter of time before the entire police force finds out about this. Oh, crud, we're gonna become wanted in Florida. What the heck are we supposed to do? Oh, this was not a good idea. This was not how this was supposed to go. Sammy's like, hurry, guys, to the mansion. Oh, God, I don't know if this is a good idea, man. We shouldn't lead her to our house. Okay, bro, sounds good. Come on, Harvey, let's go, let's go. Oh, she's right behind us. Sammy's like, come on, friends. And she's like, pull over now. This is not good. We've just become some of the most wanted criminals in all of Southwest Florida. What the heck are we supposed to do now? Shoot, is Harvey okay? Did he pull over? Where is he? Oh, wait, I see him. He's up there. Come on, Harvey. Let's go, bro. And she's like, pull over immediately. Come on, guys. I think we lost her. Oh, shoot. We're here. We're here. Sammy's like, quick, let's park inside the garage. I just said, that's a great idea, bro. Let's do it. Okay, I'm gonna park right up here. Holy smokes. Okay, close the garage. Come on, come on, come on. Yo, come on. Oh, she's outside. Yo, she's out there. And she's like, where did they go? Yo, bro, we just got away. Holy smokes. He's like, oh, no. Wait, she's still looking. She's still patrolling, guys. Keep all the lights off. He's like, oh, snap. The other garage. Oh, crap. Okay, okay. Let me close it. There we go. Uh... She's still down the street. Okay, okay, guys, let's get inside. Get inside. I just said, dude, thank you guys so much for rescuing me. He's like, bro, that was so hectic. I was like, for real, but you guys really saved me. And thanks, Harvey, for your help too, bro. He's like, thank God you're safe and sound. I said, but guys, there's a big problem. I said, I heard she called in the entire Southwest police force on us. He's like, we can't let you sleep by yourself at the apartment while Lotus is away. He's like, oh my goodness, wait, what? I said, guys, it's only a matter of time before they find us. And Sammy's like, I can't believe I'm saying this, but we, we got to escape the city then. Oh no, man. Is that a good idea? He's like, we got to go somewhere else, bro. He's like, this is too bad. I said, guys, we need to leave just for a while so that things will relax here. And he's like, oh man, I'm tired. Let's get some rest. I said, okay, but we need to leave this city right in the morning, guys. We, we can't stay here any longer. He's like, yes, absolutely. And then Harvey's like, I'm so tired, dude. I said, let's pack up in the morning and then go, okay? He's like, okay, sounds good. <sighs> okay, I guess we're headed out now. Uh, I didn't see Sammy anywhere, but I'm just gonna hop in the car. I think he said to start heading out, but we gotta leave the city. Hopefully the police aren't anywhere, but uh, yeah, we'll just go. Oh, wait, wait, there's Harvey. Oh, hold on a sec. I'm just gonna say, yo, Harvey, where's Sammy? I didn't see him this morning at all. We should probably start heading out. Oh, I should probably close the garage too. All right, there we go. Doors locked, everything nice, nice. Okay, he says, hey, Matrix. He said, oh yeah, I don't know. He said he'll meet us there. Hold on, let me just ask him, where the heck are we even going? I, I don't know what the plan is. He said, I think he has some business to take care of. Oh, snap. Wait, does that have something to do with the police? He's like, bro, I'm not even sure. Okay, we should probably go then. I said, do you know where we're going? He's like, I have no idea, bro, but Sammy said we would love it there. And he's like, and that we will fit right in with our cars. Oh, that's interesting. I'm like, okay, then where do we meet him? I think he said to meet at Starblocks. He said we should meet him at Starblocks for 1 p.m. Oh, okay. All right, let's go. Let's go. So apparently Harvey said Sammy's going to be showing us a place where our cars are going to fit in. I have no idea what that means. All I know is we're definitely wanted and we should probably not spend too much more time here in Florida. So hopefully, oh, there's Harvey. Okay, hopefully we go meet up with Sammy we can get the heck out of this city before we get arrested.
And guys, that leads us to where we are right now. I should not be here in Florida. I think Sammy and Harvey are waiting for me, but we need to get the heck out of here. The police are after us. We are in big trouble. I'm pretty much the most wanted criminal in all of Florida right now. And uh, yeah, so me recording this for you guys is putting myself in a lot of danger. I know Mashfee's still in the hospital, and I know Peeps is still in jail. Lotus doesn't even know what's going on right now. And things are at the absolute craziest moment of my entire life in Florida you guys need to keep an eye out for the next videos because I need to figure out what we're gonna do me Sammy and Harvey are on the loose hopefully we'll be back here soon enough but thanks for watching this movie guys I hope you enjoyed it tell me if you found any of the Roblox gift card codes and let me know if you want more of these movie style videos thanks for watching I'll see you all next time